Hey guys, let's get into this big hair, don't care, curly unit from Amazon. Keep watching. Pull up, I'm outside, wait about a curb. Too upset to drive it, get no money. We gon' get lit on this ride. I look too good to fight. Don't expect me to come home tonight. Find me, see you in the morning. But you never thought that I would. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Stephanie Nicole H. If you're new here, welcome. Take a pause. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so you don't miss anything on my channel. On my channel, I do a ton of different things from hair reviews to clothing hauls to recipes to DIYs. So you are in for a treat. So today, I'm going to be talking about this unit that I have on my head. Actually, I have a second unit as well, which is going to be in a blonde color. But this unit was purchased with my own money off of Amazon. And this unit wait for it only $25 now it is a synthetic unit however she is giving so that's all that really matters right so I'm gonna be showing you what this unit looked like just straight out the bag how it came and how I finessed it to look like this which let me just tell you took literally no time at all and then I'm going to try on the second unit so before I get into these units and all of the details I want to tell you about Dossier if you are not familiar with Dossier it is a French owned fragrance company that specializes in designer inspired fragrances their prices range from $29.99 and go up to $59.99. But the $59.99 price for their designer inspired fragrance is for a designer fragrance that costs like $400 plus. dollars. So they are definitely within my price range. So let me just show you these two fragrances. I got two of them here. I'm gonna tell you all about them. So the first one is called Floriental Cedarwood. And this is what the box looks like. And here is the fragrance, so very nicely packaged. And then the fragrance itself comes in this nice little bottle here and has a little magnetic top. Beautiful, love the convenience. So Floriental Cedarwood is actually inspired by Muggler's Alien. If you have not smelled Muggler's Alien, you are really missing out. This fragrance, smells like nothing I have ever smelled before in my entire life. It is so beautiful and it's just so different than anything. And let me tell you about the notes really quickly. So the notes for this fragrance, top notes is mandarin, orange blossom, middle notes is jasmine, cedarwood, base notes are amber and vanilla. Get your hands on this fragrance. It smells so good. Anytime I wear this fragrance, I always get asked, what are you wearing? It's just that type of fragrance that just leaves a memory and is a conversation starter. The next fragrance I got is Floriental Vanilla. And I just love the way that Dossier packages their fragrances. It comes with this little card, has all of the notes listed on there, what the, what the fragrance is inspired by, and um, how it works, a thank you message. So this is really, really cute. So Floriental Vanilla is based off of YSL's Black Opium. Again, here is the little bottle. Also has that magnetic top. And I do have a promo code for Dossier. I believe it's Stephanie 10, but I'm gonna put it right here so you don't miss out. Also in the description box. So this fragrance, let me read you the notes on this one. So notes on this one is mandarin, pear, pink pepper, licorice, which is interesting. Uh, jasmine are the middle notes, orange blossom, and the base notes, cedarwood, patchouli, vanilla, and coffee. So this one is slightly different from the other one. Well, it is very different, let me just say that, because Muggler's Alien, is in a league of its own. So this one is more of a lighter scent. It is very, very good. And it settles into the skin so beautifully. It's more of a subtle scent, but very, very floral. 
and just beautiful. I just love this one as well. So if you're wanting a conversation starter, go with the Floriental Cedarwood. If you're wanting something light and just beautiful, just go with the Floriental Vanilla. So you have two different options there. Dacia does not disappoint, especially with their prices and with my promo code. So make sure you check out the description box below. So now let's get into these units. All right, so as far as this unit, it's from a company on Amazon called Run M Hair Store. And this is their Afro Bomb Kinky Curly Wig with Bangs. It's 14 inches, it is synthetic. And this color is the Ombre Brown, it's a 430. And price for this unit, I cannot stress this enough, is $25.99. And the cap size is, about an average cap size, is 22.5 inches. And um, I'm gonna show you a little bit later the construction of this unit. Um, it's very different from any of the units that I have reviewed in the past, but tell me what you think down in the comments of this unit before I even show you how to install this unit. What are your initial thoughts? because I'm absolutely over the moon already. So before I get into my pros and cons of this unit, I'm gonna show you my unboxing of this unit and me putting this unit on my head. I did not do a separate unboxing this time. I just opened up the unit and then just threw it right on. So let me go ahead and show you that. And then I'm gonna show you the blonde unit and then I'm gonna give you all of my pros and cons, so keep watching. All right guys, so here are the bags that the units came in, and I'm just gonna go ahead and open this up and see what came inside. So, wig caps, and it also has a little personal thank you letter right there, which I think is so super cute. And then it also comes with like some temporary tattoos. pair of hoop earrings and then the unit so this one is the 430 color I believe so I am going to go ahead and try this on so these units are supposed to be basically just throw on and go type units um, I may have to do some cutting around the bangs but that should be it I'm hoping uh, but as far as the construction of the unit, let's just take a look. So there are two curls right here in the front. And also this is a breathable cap, which is really nice since this is a lot of hair on this unit. It does have adjustable straps as well. I don't know if you can see that, but here is that little strap. And no comb at the bottom. So this shall be interesting. So I'm gonna go ahead and adjust the adjustable straps and then throw this baby on to see what she is looking like. So she is getting very big. I really wish that there was a comb right here in the back because it is kind of sliding up. But uh, yes, big hair she is. So I'm gonna trim the bangs just a little bit. Okay, so I am loving her. Oh my gosh, big hair, natural, kinky, curly. This is a synthetic unit. It was only $25 and she is giving. So this is the um, kind of ombre four fading into a number 30. 
I actually bought a pick off of Amazon because I thought I was going to need that for this unit. But literally, this unit is just throw on and fluff out, and that is it. I did have to cut the bangs a little bit, as you saw, but throw on and fluff. I am here for this. Let me turn around so I can show you all angles. Side, back. Other side. All right, she is so cute. Oh my gosh, this was definitely a steal for $25. Make sure you check out my description box. I'm gonna put a link for this unit. They have tons of other different colors and I'm gonna try on this blonde one next. So keep watching. So here is the blonde unit, but just wanted to show you that everything that came with the brown unit came with the blonde one as well. And I'm actually just gonna throw on these earrings right now. These are actually a smaller, um hoop than the last one which is nice i'm a hoop girl it just broke <laughs> the back just broke off okay so i have to just wear some of my own earrings but let me go ahead and put on the unit so same construction on this one has the two combs in the front, no comb in the back, but does have the adjustable straps, which I already connected. So let me throw on this and see if it's that easy to install this one as well. just a little bit shorter than the other one. If you're good with a needle and thread, go ahead and do yourself a favor and install a back comb back here. So this one is called Ombre Blonde, and this one was a little bit cheaper, $25.69. So let me go ahead and turn around so you can see all angles. So it seems like this one was a little bit more fussed out than the other one, but I guess it just makes it look natural. So yeah, here she is. Let me know which one is your favorite, the ombre brown or this ombre blonde. All right, pause, let me go get some earrings since that other one broke. All right, so now that I have all my earrings, I feel like a human being. So let's get into the pros and cons of these units. So pros, price, $25 for these units. And this unit, looks so extremely natural. Um, I think I'm gonna buy some of the other colors as well. I do know that they have like an ombre burgundy one. They have just a normal natural black one. I've even seen a ombre purple one. So they have a ton of different colors in this type of unit. So price, amazing. Also Amazon two day shipping, you cannot beat two day shipping. And then the variety of different colors that they have is also a plus. So I kind of wanted to step outside of my comfort zone and only get colored units instead of just a regular black unit, which I'm really happy that I did because I've been trying to really stay away from the natural black color. And if you've been following my channel since the beginning, I said from my very first video, I'm a jet black kind of girl and I stuck to that. And now I don't even like that dark color on my skin tone. It's crazy how much people just change and evolve. 
and I'm just loving the browns and the blondes on my skin tone. So I will say that the construction of this unit is a positive and a negative. I love that it does have the combs right here in the front and it does have the breathable cap. However, please install a comb in the back of this unit. I would greatly appreciate it. But since I do know how to work a needle and thread, I will probably just do that on my own. But I just wish it would have came straight out the box like that. So negatives. Um, I don't think I have any negatives on this unit. I'm trying to look on my clothes on the floor to see if I have any shedding and I have not received any shedding on this unit. Tangling, you really can't say, you know, if this unit will tangle or not because it is a kinky curly unit and it's synthetic. You will not be washing this unit. You will not be combing it out really. You can use a pick, but um, you can't really say if it'll tangle or not because that's irrelevant. But shedding, no shedding. Um, it just looks so natural. I love this. Love it, love it, love it. Tell me what you think. Which color was your favorite? Was it the brown or is it the blonde? Um, but I'm gonna put everything down in the description box below. Again, I did purchase this with my own money, so I'm gonna put the links to Amazon down in the description box. Unfortunately, I don't have any promo codes or anything for you, but you really don't need it because it's only $25. So that is it for this review. I um, am obsessed. If you can't already tell, I am obsessed with these units. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, I'll see you all next time.